welcome to another episode of Snug Radio's Retro Lounge. That's going to sound better, isn't it? Now I've put my headphones on. Ah, oh. um, well, what are we doing this evening? Well, what we're doing is we're playing games <clears throat> that have characters that are featured in Marvel Comics. Um, sizably more DC characters in retro games. But, however, um, we have the likes of Spider-Man, um, Iron Man, the Hulk, Captain America, and just just a bunch, bunches of superheroes. So, you know, let's see what we're going to get. I've not played any of these games. I've started them to make sure they're started, but I've not looked at them. So, I'm as much in the dark as you. However, can't be in the dark on this telly. I've got to be over there. So, let's boop across. Boop. There we go. And we'll have a look at our first game. As always, <coughs> excuse me, we're doing them in alphabetical console order. So, we're starting with Game Boy Advance. And we're starting with the Invincible Iron Man. So, let me get you as green and see what Invincible Iron Man looked like. On the Game Boy Advance. Oh. Shit, the hammer's gone. Okay, uh, this is familiar looking. Jump, shoot, such a jump and shoot. Starting again now we time we get Oh! 
possibly need them. Oh, can't time to jump right. Shoot upwards, that's disappointing. Same point. Missing. Make it for me, yeah. No. So talk. Can't get through there. We're in a dead end. I'm 
blast through with a super punch. I think if I could, I would have done that by now. I don't know. Um, I mean, is it somewhat where I have to kill myself? Is it? One of these where I have to go back and kill. Oh, maybe, maybe there's a, some sort of trap door. very long that time did I so 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 oh hang on a minute is this is this open before was that, oh, was that a switch then Oh, my God. 
Yo, yo, ho, yay! Here's Nutty Cluster. So you better watch yourself, you people now. She'll be moderating you. Although she's a bit out of practice. practice at moderating. See, now, this is why, this is why we need a nutty cluster. It looked all right, but, because we had a week where it was a bit quiet in the edit. I, it was like, oh no. Um, there you go, that was the Invincible Iron Man on the Game Boy Advance. And we're going to follow that up with another Game Boy Advance game now. And it's going to be the first of two, well, two games. The first of two Spider-Man games that um, we'll be playing this evening. Um, and it's Spider-Man 2. There are a lot of Spider-Man games and there's a lot of the same titled games spread across different consoles. And one day we might look at them all and see how different they are. But for tonight, we are going to... Where's Spider-Man 2? There. Spider-Man, Spider-Man. Okay. So, let's sort the volume out first. And then uh, Nutty Cluster. So, Nutty Cluster hasn't seen the new pad. She wasn't not being here for a bit. This is a, a Sega Saturn replica pad. Has six buttons. For doing um, Mega Drive games. And two analog sticks, which is quite nice. So and it matches my bag. Yeah, this this bag here. So Okay, so based on the film, Spider-Man. Ooh, what do I reckon? What from left to right, hitting people? Perhaps? Oh, seven and a half minutes. We're making deliveries. a time limit. How are we going to do this now? What have we got? Mm. 
Whoa. Okay. Where are we delivering it? So he broke a window to deliver a pizza. Nope. Well, I'm stuck. Why can't I? <laughs> Stop it, you jackass. Dead end. I feel like I should be on the rooftops. Oh, do I only have a certain amount of um, web fluid? Jackass. Go on. <sighs> what? Ooh! That's not even close to making making a, a jumping. Oh, okay. Ooh. Yeah, what do you mean jumping? Don't you make that noise when you just get up? Pizza, dude. Do I have to? I don't have to go back, surely. She waiting for a pizza. Right. So I can't get up there anyway. Oh. No, 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 no. Stay in the lift. It's obviously death released. Ah, now I do notice that there is an arrow pointing in the direction that I should go. So, gotcha. We have to. Get a pizza. There's no way we're going to complete this, is there? It'd be ridiculous to even consider it. I don't see an arrow now, though. Telling me where the pizza needs to go. So, yes, I think you were right there, Naughty Cluster, that it is, the arrow does point to where you should go, um, except I can't see the arrow now. Annoying. Okay. Now it looked like I could get across there. Ah, oh, fucking dead end. Uh, no, it's not scratched. Apparently, my, when my phone rings, my Mac goes. Hey, you don't need to carry on playing that game you're playing. Your phone's ringing. Right, 
that's probably the guy who wants the pizza. Where did he go? Is he further up or lower down? I smashed the window, so it's gonna be. Nope! Oh, tits. Would be helpful if it showed you where to go. Yes, I delivered a pizza. I've delivered two pizzas. And I've got um, one minute and 34 seconds to deliver. Uh, three more. Well, two more now. Super not helpful telling you where it is. Oh, these dead ends. Oh, what a pen in the ass. Your deliveries, I'm gonna get sacked. down or further up? Stop it. I think further up then. Thing is, once you brought the windows, it's really difficult to uh, traverse each level. never found the um, the next person I don't think oh 
Well, that's great. How do I get out of there? Oh, sod it. Surely it can't just be like brute force going around all the different levels till you find somebody who wants pizza. Alright, that's as high as we go. So, not this building then? search by building or do we search by level? It does seem quicker to do. There we go. do it through the lift. Go back up. Oh, oh. How much more up do you have? Do you have more up? It's not enough that I can get through though. Grr. Oh, oh. So, so we were able to get through Can't get through duct in there no now. Oh yeah we can. Oh Dead end. Hurrah. Then, oh. Found this other person, have we? Super spider sense that. Look at that. Come on. Go back. Go forward. No. There we go. No. How am I going to make him get out there now? Wow, jeez, so complicated. 
Sure I've been in here. Oh no. Unsmashed window, I can't have been. Oh, God's sake. How do I get on the ceiling? Don't want to get on the ceiling there. Don't want to get on the ceiling there. Oh well. Look. We've played enough. We got half of... Um, possibly more than half of our uh, things. Pizzas. Pizza deliveries, that's the one. But we're going to move on. We're going to move on to the NES. We're going to travel back in time to the NES. Um... So, yeah, there it was. Mm, I won't play music while I'm on the stream deck, uh, stream labs screen note. So, here we are with Marvel's X Men. Marvel's X Men. So, oh, shit. <clears throat> Here we go. Should we start with a practice? We should be. Oh. Not hundred percent sure what's going on here, to be honest with you. jump and I've got what I assume is an attack. Oh, I'm frozen. I'm dead. I'm a dead. So obviously I can only attack with my claws. Yeah, possibly. There's no indicators on the screen at all to tell me if I'm dead or not. What are we supposed to be doing? Is it just there? Uh, I mean, there's not even a score showing on the screen that I can see. We've got a, a license for a, a, some sort of comic called X-Men. Um, have you got any ideas of what we can do for a game for it? Or, I don't know, Phil. Yeah. Leave it with me. I've got a dinner hour coming up. I'll see what I can knock together. I've never read any of the comic books. What, what, uh, what should we do? Oh, I don't know. Do we have a game lying around that we can just slap on um, characters that look like these guys? Well, maybe. Let's... But 
what about skulls? Ah, they won't live to see skulls. Don't worry about skulls. But how are they going to know what to do? Well, we'll put it all in a manual. But nobody reads the manual. I know, I know. Don't worry, fam. Just do it. So, so, I see Cyclops is dead. very well me just carrying on doing this but oh does he it looks a bit no no right is it perhaps because it's practice let's reset it let's start again We'll actually do oh now I can't move anything can't be your only option. Right. Push that. Play on. Practice is the only option. Nope. Nope. Just no. Um, instead, we're going to move to the Mega Drive for uh, for two games. Two games on the Mega Drive. And the first one is the second of our Spider-Man games. This is called Spider-Man Venom colon Maximum Carnage. So, yeah, there you go. Sega. Elgin had some sort of Spider-Man license since their name's been on both. Oh, in fact, no, it was just on that toy, uh, that X-Men one, wasn't it? Mm. Okay, Spider-Man, Venom and Carnage. Oh. Dagger. 
Cloak and Dagger. Did you get it? There's a bit of story for you. Uh, the 90s mostly Spider Man. Okay, what we got? Jump, flips. Oh, I don't know what any of these things do. Well, all I've got is seems to be a whip. I don't know. Ah, oh, look at this, we're using our six buttons. I see. So we've got a Streets of Rage cloney thing. So I've got a punch, can't find a kick just yet. So I would like all the buttons that do things to be near each other rather than not. That often go the other direction. my finger on the wrong button now I've got seems to be on grab rather than punch what am I doing do that more I can't crouch either which is a bit weird said continue is it gonna continue or put me right back at the start again right back at the start well that's not continue is it
see up and down don't do anything. longer arms than me. That has.
Oh, thought I was going to do it. But I'm not, because we're not continuing. That's it, we're done. With um... Spider-Man, Venom, Maximum Carnage. I assume later on in the game you get to play as Venom. But we have to move on. Time is ticking away, but not ticking as far as I thought. Because we're only halfway through and we're halfway through our games. There you go. Um, so, our next uh, uh, Mega Drive game is The Incredible Hulk. Um, so, let's find you and there we go. Under the Tuz. T for the Oh, that's either a massive screen or super super small. Oh, it's not that's not right, surely. Tell you what, let's do fit to screen and shrink the bugger to fit. How's that? So why white screen? Did we white screen Mega Drive games? Did we? Oh. Uh. Okay. Click the wrong thing. That'll be why it was the wrong size screen. Now it would be freaking massive. Transform fit to screen. Okay. Not as widescreen. Hulk smash. Uh, yes, yes, Naughty Cluster. I did break it temporarily. Then I fixed it. With guile, cunning and genius. Oh, it's already on easy. We can't make it any easier. Disappointing. This has got a weird button scheme as well. So we've got nothing on that button, which is what I would expect to be punch. We've got jump. So. Can't fight though, with ranged weapons or anything. I just have to take a beating. That doesn't seem right, does it? Pick that up. Come on, it's a crate. It's a crate, and there's a thing down there that I should be able to pick up. Why can I not? Right, so what? How did that happen? But I can't punch the crate. 
so let's go back up. And I feel like I should be able to get up there. Do I wait for him to get really close and then uppercut the shit out of him? It's not going to stop shooting, is it? I mean, I'd like to be able to do a, like a Hulk smash on him like that. Rah, boom. Like that. Only if that's the key. Ooh. More jumping. Right, what button was that? Right. See, there's stuff up there, but I just don't know how to get to it. Oops. Oh yeah, we're doing a smurf thing again, aren't we? Can I pop through the door? Yeah, maybe. So Bruce Banner can't, can't. Can't hit things, I was gonna say. Can I jump in here? Oh, oh, no I can't. Hulk allergic to water. Um, well, let's start it again and see if we can go through the doors like you, um, like Nutty Cluster recommended. I don't want to put my name in, just... not renowned for his door usage. Ow. 
Oh, no doors in this one. Still think that's summit. But I don't have any buttons that do anything to it. So we have the door. No door options, I'm afraid. Shame I can't punch them while they're in the air. Oh, I can. I can. Oh. Right. We know that we can get on there. Just. Not sure what this coin does. No water for Hulk. <laughs> oh, nearly did it, Em. Now, do I change back to David Banner to do that? Looks like a little tunnel, doesn't it? But I don't know how to do that. None of the buttons. down the ladder or do we go up, up, up this ladder instead? Can't jump over this guy. Right, I felt we should have gone down there. Oh, look, stuff up there. I'll go get up there. So it must be somewhere. Hey, man with cement mixer, piss off. Oh. Destroy that. So, how do I get back there then? Can't 
that's land on the windowsills. Ah, that's irritating. I mean, I can credible look again, or Fire that gun. Oh, I can't get through it as um, as the Hulk. got further than our first game, I guess. Do, 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 do. There we go. As always with video games, the bad guys win in the end. Uh, anyway, that was the Incredible Hulk on the Mega Drive. So now what we're going to do, what, 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 how are we going to play this? We're going to play this. Oh. I'm going to regret playing a PSP game before a SNES game, but I'm going to do it anyway. We're going to move to uh, the PSP, as discussed. Um, we did have a run where we played a lot of games on the on the PSP because I quite like it. It's, it's got some good games. So um, we're going to play Marvel Superhero Squad. It's a slightly bigger screen. And this one's definitely widescreen. So let's move it to the middle a little bit for you. Um, yes. Marvel Superhero Squad. Wow. Okay. Let's see what we've got.
Okay. Okay. Don't know, are we gonna adventure? Or are we gonna, ooh, ooh, ooh. Talk in my language, what a cheat. Oh, oh, they're locked. But, I mean, let's, let's, do battle tell you what we'll put well let's play the game first but we might put the adventure section onto a revisit maybe oh fighting game against the computer I'm gonna get my ass kicked We've not seen a Thor on the games we've played so far, so let's do that. And um, computer can play Silver Surfer. Oh, should we handicap? No, let's not. It's too confusing. Let's just go for it. Oh. Let's start with the first one. Thor! Silver Surfer! Ready! Fight! Oh. Right, got my buttons. Found a fly button, but that's not gonna help. Right. Look, just leave me alone for a minute. Whoa. You must not be too negative. Right, I think I've got a block in there. Can't work out what my controls are. Do the Right, shoulder buttons don't do anything. Yeah, maybe should have handicapped that guy. I keep forgetting that it's a bloody oh. It's cool looking. Let's just go back to the controls. See what we've actually got. So, right. That's weird, isn't it? So... <clears throat> See the con... <laughs> oh, yeah, the controls are mapped, right? I think. X... A... X, A, B and Y. X, A, B... Why, why not? Right. 
So it's these four buttons that do stuff. These two do not. Shoulder buttons do not in this game. Okay. Um, so that should be back, should it? See, because we, we're trying to convert letters, translate letters into Sony symbols. It's weird, isn't it? The D-pad works for choosing all this, but as soon as the fight starts, it switches to an analog stick. Right, well, who do we want to see fight this time? Let's, let's be Iron Man and Wolverine. Okay, so. There was no way of me changing that. Let's look at a different arena. I don't think I'm any better, I think he's just stupid. Oh, he's getting past that. Start with that strong. I think if I have got repulsors on my feet I, and I can do that, that I shouldn't, um, I shouldn't be able to bring out at all, but apparently I can. No, we both out that time. Yeah. Oh no, gonna fall off myself then. I'm gonna be stupid. Okay, well look, it's a fighting game. 
Um, I've just seen some of the characters that are on it, but um, well, like we say, there is an adventure mode, and you know, possibly we might we might put it on um, revisit. Who knows? We'll we'll have a production meeting and see if it's a good idea. Anyway, that was the um, Marvel Superhero Squad on the PSP. As always, if you think I've given any of these games short shrift, you can always email us and let me know. Retro at snugradio.co.uk um, Always happy to replay a game. We might have no, Revisit would cover that, I guess. I was going to say we might have something on the wheel called Replay, where requests from viewers um, could go on it. I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, we're going to move on to um, our final two games now on the snares. Um, by dint of it ending with an S, so it's usually the last game we play. So... Our first nice game. It's Captain America and the Avengers. Uh, probably not the Captain America you used to. Now, I haven't turned any of these other games down since the first couple, so I hope it's been all right. Avengers. There you go. Oh, it's Jobs, it's Jobs an illustrator. Right. Vision. Well, you're right, Red Skull, I probably can't beat you, but we're going to have a little look and see. Well, it's called Captain America and the Avengers, isn't it? So let's start with Captain America. We can play another one later. Oh, no, not Conquer the World. America still needs your help. Turn very fast. No. Does it hit him coming back?
makes it getting any weaker. Take it from behind. I get away fast enough if I don't move straight away, but can't stop moving. Don't think I'm doing it any damage though. Can I leave? No, I can't. Did I just do that? Can't be right, can it? No! I'm hitting it lots. No! No! How do we do the slide thing? to be doing something wrong. Don't have any more buttons though. Thank you. 
getting it in the back sometimes as well. I wish there was some sort of gauge that showed you how far. So, this seems a perfect one for you guys to um, let me know what the actual F I'm supposed to be doing. Why, why can I not kill this guy? Let me know in the comments. Now look, he's stuck facing the wrong direction and I'm kicking the shit out of him. And yet, he's still not dying. So what, what are we doing wrong? What's going on here? Why is it not doing it? This is not the way we're supposed to be doing it, is it? So. However, there is a little bug where if you go to the top right hand corner, it doesn't know where you are. It's not helping. I just punch him. Is that it? Really? I, I can't believe it after all that. to try and punch these guys instead then, don't I? Rather than shields. Well, we've wasted so much time on that other robot. And instead of using your superpower, you just punch him. Shame. Well, look, we're getting to that time of night where um, I'm happy to leave it and go. Uh, you know, look, look, we'll do it, do it again another time if we want. I don't, I don't tend to delete playlists at all. So, um, oh, I wonder. We could possibly do shows where we replay a playlist and see if we're any better or worse at it. I don't know. Maybe. Anyway, this this is our last game. This is called um, Marvel Super Heroes War of the Gems. So. Let's see if it's any easier to understand. Or, I know going from left to right and punching people is easy to understand. But.
Ah, the Infinity Stones. Oh, oh, gems. Okay. What do you reckon? Fighty? Left to righty fighty? Or... No story. It's nearly nine o'clock. Okay. Oh, did I just press no by accident? Okay. Just let's move on. Yeah, looks like it, doesn't it? And we've got that weird layout of buttons again. Oh, where's he tippy toeing? Okay, where's the gem? Oh, I do not like the shaking screen business. Am I supposed to be able to get fast enough to get through? The other buttons don't seem to do anything. <sighs> Deep breath. Off. He's gonna kill me, isn't he? Oh, what happened there? I think we hit each other. But he killed me. Oh, 
Let's try somewhere else. Jesus, come on, you motherfucker. Oh, that's not good. You know, actually, back to that replay a playlist, what we should do is play a playlist, but play it backwards. Because by the time we get to the seventh or eighth game, I've started to have enough, you know. I can't concentrate as well. Um, but all of that is just to say, uh, let's go to the wheel, shall we? Um and the wheel. Last week we closed it and then opened it and closed it again and we got the, um, we screwed it up and I said, ah, oh, look at it next week and uh, do you know what? I didn't didn't look at it so let's see if we can get it better looking today do you know what? That will do pig that will do uh, so let's find out what we're going to be playing oh did i hide did i hide marvel yeah it looks like i did yep so let's see what we're playing next week oh it was nearly revisit again unplayed snes we can manage that we can work that out. It doesn't need any input from an audience for us to work that out. So that's fine. Um, but we would like your input, you know. It would be super useful. Um, where do I need to be? I need to be that one. Yes, I do. Um, yeah, for things like revisits and replays and, you know, games. Maybe games we've never played that you think we should have a look at from the eight. 16 32 bit era that'd be great email us retro at stugradio.co.uk it's just there retro at stugradio.co.uk um but probably the easiest will be just to comment under this video whether it's on twitch or on youtube so either of those would be great um if you're watching this now on a Monday night from 7 o'clock, live on Twitch, then you already know we're on Twitch. If you're watching it on YouTube, then then you know we're on YouTube. It has Snug Radio in both places. Um, but you YouTube listen, watchers, you could come and watch us on Twitch if you wanted. Um, as it goes out live on a Monday night from 7. So we, we're, um, we're Snug Radio in both those places but we're also snug radio in a whole host of other places yes facebook twitter tiktok all those places we're, we're there as snug radio and we also have a discord um there'll be a link to it in the show notes and um you can come there and join us there it's been very quiet recently um but 
you're always welcome to come and join us on the Snug Radio Discord. Um, did you know, moderator extraordinaire Nutty Cluster has her own design shop where she does super designs of things. And you can find that at inkyspiration. Um, dot, dot redbubble.com and anyway there'll be a link in the show notes the, the store is called inkyspiration um so go there and buy things yeah you, you won't be sorry and i also have a design shop called the glorious idiot um go there and buy other things you still won't be sorry be, it's, it's good it's good um so i think that's everything Done the websites, done the Discord, done the shops. Um, all I think that remains is for me to thank moderator extraordinaire Nutty Cluster for joining us tonight. It's nice to see her back, in it, in it, boys and girls. We've noticed her absence, and um, just to say thank you for watching, and we'll be back at the same time, same place next week. Uh, I've been Matt. This has been. Snug Radio's Retro Lounge. Play something retro. Goodbye. <laughs>